Hey, what's going on everybody? January Flowers here, your favorite homegirl. Happy Friday, Pooh. If you new to the channel, welcome. If you returning to the channel, welcome back, Pooh. We're getting into some tea. Now, you know Quavo is in the news. He got upset. And I hear Quavo and Chris Brown beefing real bad. Child, I'm over on X and they spilling all the tea. The hood therapist had this to say. Quavo and Chris Brown didn't hop on no IG live, didn't subtweet. Or go back and forth on social media. Them boys got straight in the studio and you gotta respect it. Now fans already feel like Quavo is going through something. Y'all know it's Aries season. And I believe Quavo is that Aries season. And you know Chris Brown allegedly they going back and forth over a girl. Hoodie Switcher said this. Chris Brown and Quavo beefing about a chick definitely wasn't on my bego card of 2024. What's going on, Quavo? Let's see what these comments saying because I can imagine that he probably feeling away. But where does the beef come from? Somebody said they actually got real beef, y'all. I feel like rap fans are so desperate for drama. Y'all can't tell the difference between people who actually ooh, don't like each other in a friendly conversation. Now, my thing is this. How far back does the beef with Quavo and Chris Brown go? Because I believe one time it was a rumor back in the day. I think it was before like people was really, really recording everything. They said Mego Camp and I think Chris Brown Camp had got into it at the BET Awards. That was a rumor a couple of years ago. So maybe they still been beefing since then. Somebody said real beef, yet were pictured sitting next to each other over a few months ago. Seemed like it was squash. But to bring up a old girl after three kids later is cornball behavior. Yes. So it must be a girl Quavo was the in that Chris Brown linked up with. That's what I'm gathering. Somebody said, oh, they rapping or scrapping. Anything else ain't beef. Dag, these fans sick of them. But y'all, music people do that. They rather go back on songs. People not really, you know, throwing hands with it. Y'all, wow. Somebody else said, solid undercard performance from both sides. So... I haven't really heard the disses that they're throwing to each other. So like, most likely I won't be able to play the songs due to copyright reason. But we do have some of the lyrics. Shout out to Groove. Groove said we about to get a Quavo and Breezy rap beef. Now this is going to be interesting. Because you know Chris Brown, one thing about him. Chris Brown going to clap back. So this is a shout out from the page called Say Cheese. This is what they said. They said Quavo responds to Chris Brown shots with a new song called Tinder. He said this as a part of the song. You did a be wrong and now to be gone. She posted with a thug and Cali the B phone. She won't come home, done beat her up. It must be the drugs. Need to cross out your plug. Hmm, I'm not impressed. You know what I'm saying? For him to be the a rapper and Chris Brown is the singer. Hmm. Did Chris Brown respond? Let's see if they put his lyrics up. Oh, I did hear this. Now, I did hear this that Quavo put into his song, Don't Be Her Up. Uh, somebody said, Quavo, that was a weak a diss, making light of domestic violence as a bar. Jack, that actually might be the worst rap beef of all time. Yeah, he did say that. Wow. I don't get it. He mad at him because the girl with him? Wow, this is a beef I didn't see coming, but I know Chris Brown ain't going to back down from it. And who do I see coming out on top? You know how fellas do it. I see him going back and forth for a minute. Fellas usually end up with, um, what it called? The fellas usually end up with um a joint album. So I wouldn't be surprised if they beefing now, y'all. And then what, a couple months or so down the road, you know what they're going to be saying. What they're going to be saying, oh, Quavo and Chris Brown coming out with a joint album. Who's supporting that album, man? You going to support the album, man? Ain't nobody doing that. Now people talking about you can't rap about um that because what you did to Sweetie, child, they done brought Sweetie back into the mix. But with good reason, Quavo, you can't really say, and I'm not going to really, you know, try to show all that so y'all can really see it. But you can't really say that he, you know, going to do that when she come home late. Knowing that, you know, allegedly you handle Sweetie too. I mean, it's no, 
nothing new that these young entertaining men who come into the industry have shooken a few heads. You know what I'm saying? Allegedly, Sweetie. You know what I'm saying? Well, Sweetie said it's true. I'm just saying allegedly for the video. But Sweetie said it's true. And we know, Rihanna, it is true. So we know these mans have caught these girls yeah. up. Quavo cooked Chris Brown. Somebody said, he said smashing my old B not going to make us equal on that 1942 because I don't F with Quavo. She like Casamigos. Oh, she don't like that Migos. Oh, me versus Quavo. Or am I tripping? I'm tired of Quavo and these auto-tune songs. They said Quavo is canceled. Beef with somebody else. Quay Quay. Wow. The people sick of him. Well, y'all comment below. It looks like the boys are getting active. Child, they beefing. Let me know if y'all want me to follow the tea because it looks like <sighs> this could possibly just stay on wax. Because I feel like with most cases with the guys, it does. It hasn't been too many recent rat beefs between men that has gotten physical. The girls brawling more than um the men. I think the last thing I heard was Cardi had ran up on Sweetie. Child, Sweetie just getting it all type of witch away. Sweetie stay in the news though. But y'all comment below. Let me know what y'all think about this tea. It popped out. And I said, not Chris and Quavo. If I had to pick a, a you know, a dog in a fight. I mean, it's Patty. Ultimately, what they brawling over, which is a girl, you know, I'm not surprised. Oh, boys and their toys, you know how that go. And my thing is, where the girl at? Because, girl, they speaking on you like you ownership property sales. If I were you, I would just come forward like, um, hello. <laughs> yeah, I done had both of y'all. And at the end of five days, it's my choice. That's what I would say, queen. Step into the light, cutie. You know what I'm saying? Stand in your truth. Own it. These men are playing in your face, but... For that beginning part of it, I'ma just let them beef. Cause it's gonna be cute to let them play in my Let me stop. Let me stop because that's so toxic. But if I was her, I would possibly say, you know, I'm neither one of your property, but I have dated both. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's kind of giving property the way he's talking about don't don't handle it if she come home late. Oh, she don't want the amigo, she went to cuz amigo and all that stuff like that. It is giving childish, you know, play play. That's why I said boys and they toys, but if I was her, I'd capitalize. Make a couple t-shirts, you know what I'm saying? CB versus Quavo. What's T? But she probably can't do that. <laughs> I please all day. But y'all comment below and let me know what y'all think about this T. This is sporadic T. This is current T. These guys are acting out. Quavo been getting mad. Let me show you the video. Really? Really? I'm a celebrity lookalike. Of course, I got the best ad libs. Boo boo! I'm a celebrity lookalike. Of course, when I'm out in public, people think they just see the ghost of takeoff. <laughs> honest, that is wild. They say he's going as takedown online instead of takeoff. He said when people see him out in public, they think that he is takeoff, which he does give him, especially how he dressed. And stuff like that. Very subtle. Very take off tease. So I thought it was Quavo that got upset. Oh, they all in the news. So it was Offset that said not that twin stuff. So Offset is upset at the guy. Got it. Quavo beating with Chris, beefing with Chris Brown. Child, I thought, girl, I thought, I thought all this was the same story. But look, it's three. <laughs> Offset is upset over the influencer. Got it. Y'all, it's a lot going on. Look, I'm going to try to stay on top of this tea. But what y'all think about this beef? When it comes to the guys fighting over the girls, how do you feel about it? Sometimes in a moment, it can be cute. But I think ultimately, it's not. I do want to know who the young lady is. Oh, so according to TMZ, it's over Karuchi. This is so interesting. Chris Brown just released a deluxe edition of 1111. Double it down with his beef with Quavo. With the fire renew shot at the woman they've both. Oh my goodness. So you know what this is giving me? This is giving me. I need some sales. I didn't know it was over Karuchi. I thought it was over a new girl. Like someone told me it was Karuchi. But I didn't think so. Because I thought she was with a whole nother person. I'm not fully understanding this tea. It's given what's going on. On a song freak, CB snaps on Quavo with a clever punchline over a supercharged version of Nelly Air Force Ones. F my bees. 
they gonna make us equal sipping at 1942 because i don't do quava freak be like casamigos not migos <sighs> here they go y'all it says chris brown reignited the beef in january he better stop it that's supposed to be a blast month they said freak also features lil wayne jonah lucas and t greasley um i think that's whack all this is over karuchi i mean not that karuchi is a deserving of a man brawling over her but is she even with even oh god yo that's what i be talking about it why do men do that i think it's for sales y'all comment below if you think it's anything other than sales let me know like the video share and subscribe this is giving me very much so boys and their egos i'm thinking it's a new girl girl it's karuchi ain't she in a relationship let me see who is she dating I mean, I don't think even one of them with her right now. If they are, I'm just not sure. It's giving me phony Fei Fei. Y'all comment below. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Stay locked to the channel. It's giving me these boys. <laughs> they doing the most. And it's giving me to bring light and eyes to their music. And even one of them, I don't think really want her right now. You see what I'm saying? Now, if the beef is real, it's petty. Over what? You know? it's whack but y'all comment below let me know what y'all think i just wanted to share this because i was wondering like what is it giving if it does continue though i do wonder what it would ignite out of chris brown will we get more rapping from him but mm -mm. now it's giving me ploy y'all comment below let me know what y'all think is it giving phony faith -ay? comment below or do y'all think this real street beef street 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 beef that's what some of the fans saying. They rapping or scrapping. Let's get into it. i see you on the next one. But remember this. Do the best you can with what you got. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.